This upper body joint freeing sequence can be a gentle way to free up the joints and to support their health and mobility. For this upper body joint freeing sequence, I usually like to sit in a modified hero's position with one block underneath the sitting bones between the ankles. If this is not accessible to you, that's fine. You can sit in easy pose or you can also sit in the chair. Make sure that your hips feel leveled, supported, and in neutral, that your pelvis is in neutral. Your ribs over the hips, the shoulders broad, the top of the head over the heart. And as we move through the sequence, take care to not push through any type of pain or discomfort. Move within your range of motion. Let's pause for a moment, take a releasing breath. And when you're ready, bring the arms up parallel to the floor, the palms facing down, and gently draw the head of the arm bones in, toward, in towards the sockets. Hug the shoulder blades together. Keep the heart buoyant, lifted, elongate the spine. And when you inhale, lift the fingertips up towards the ceiling, the palms forward. Exhale, bend at the wrists, and the fingertips point to the floor. Inhale, palms forward. Exhale, fingertips to the floor. About three more. Move slowly with the breath. Let the breath be deep. The exhale is complete. Try to keep the wrists fairly in line with the shoulders to the best of your ability. And I think we have one more. And then the next time the palms come parallel to the floor, Pause there, make gentle fists with the hands, and then draw circles with the hands so that you feel this movement in the wrist. And the circles can go in the same direction or opposite of each other, that's fine. And then reverse direction. The palms come parallel to the floor. Take a full breath in here. As you exhale, the elbows bend in towards the ribs and the hands relax to the thighs with the palms facing up. And take a breath here in transition. Now keep the hands on the thighs, the palms facing up. Open and close the hands a few times as if you're squeezing sponges. Let this be really active. Stretching out through the fingertips and then squeezing the fingers in towards the palms about twice more. And then relaxing the hands, bring the arms up again parallel to the floor. How do the arm bones draw into the sockets? Stay broad across the collarbones, keep the base of the neck relaxed. And this time open the palms up towards the ceiling. Imagine that you're holding plates. Inhale, open the hands out to the side. It's a lateral stretch. Exhale, the hands slowly come in towards each other so the pinkies face each other or they might touch. Inhale, hands out to the side. Exhale, inward. So it's a side stretch on the wrists. Do that about two to three more times, moving within your comfortable range of motion. Imagine you're still holding the plates. And then the hands come back to neutral, palms towards the floor, keep the arms lifted, secure the head of the arm bones again in the sockets, make gentle fists, and once more draw circles with the hands. Keep your breath steady. And reverse direction of the circles. And the palms come parallel to the floor. Take a full breath in here. And as you exhale, elbows come in towards the ribs. Relax the back of the hands to the thighs. Sit tall. Release the breath. And take another breath here in transition. Eyes can close. When you're ready, bring the arms up again parallel to the floor. Shoulder blades hug in towards each other. Top of the head reaches up to the sky. Open the palms towards the ceiling. Take a full breath in here. And as you exhale, fingertips touch the shoulders. Try to keep the elbows in line with shoulders if you can. Inhale, open the arms. Exhale, close. Inhale, open. 
Exhale, close. Two more. The next time fingertips come to the shoulders, pause there, take a full breath. Now inhale again here. Let the breath go. Inhale, open the elbows wide. And exhale, elbows touch at midline. And it's okay if the elbows can't touch, just have them hug in towards each other. Inhale, open. Exhale, close. A few more. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Once more, keep the spine elongated, root down through the sitting bones. And the next time the elbows open out to the sides, keep them here, shoulder blades secured down the back, brought across the arm, uh, brought across the collarbones, bring the arms up into cactus. So the wrists are in line with the elbows, elbows in line with the shoulders to the best of your ability, fingers open wide, palms forward. Take a full breath in here. And exhale, rotate the arms so the fingertips point down towards the floor. Inhale, arms up to cactus. Exhale, rotate the arms down. Once more. And next time you come up to cactus, exhale the arms together to midline. Hands touch down through heart center. Relax the hands to the thighs with the palms up. Sit tall and take a releasing breath. Eyes can close. And when you're ready again, open the eyes. Bring the arms out parallel to the floor, palms facing down, head of the arm bones plug in. Root down through the sitting bones, lengthen up through the top of the head. Open the palms again towards the sky. Exhale, bring the fingertips to the shoulders. Now inhale, elbows go in line with the shoulders out to either side. Exhale here. Now if it's available to you, inhale, open the arms out. Looks at the letter T. Exhale, bending at the elbows, fingertips to shoulders. Four more. About two more. Keep the head of the arm bones plugged in, spine elongated. Next time the fingertips come to shoulders, keep them there. Exhale, the elbows come in parallel to each other. The arms open forward, palms down. Exhale, slowly the elbows come in towards the ribs. And this time relax the hands down, palms to the thighs. Sit tall, take a releasing breath. And move our attention to the neck. Elongating the spine again, taking care to keep it elongated, top of the head to the sky. Take a full breath in here. Exhale, chin to chest. Inhale, the head to neutral or the head gently tips back. Exhale, chin to chest. A few more times. Next time the head comes to neutral, pause there, take a full breath, releasing breath if you need it. Inhale, lengthen up through the top of the head. Exhale, slowly release the right ear towards the right shoulder, but keep the shoulders broad and even and in, in, um, parallel to the floor. Inhale, head comes up to neutral. 
Exhale, slowly lower the left ear to the left shoulder without pressing the left shoulder up. Inhale, head to neutral. Exhale, the right ear to the right shoulder. Now this time, keep it here. Take two to three belly breaths or long, deep breaths. Breathe in and out of the nose using the weight of the head to feel a gentle stretch in the left side of the neck. The next time you inhale, come up through neutral. Exhale, left ear relaxes toward the left shoulder and breathe into it. Keep the sitting bones rooted, ribs over the hips, shoulders broad. Got another breath here. Remember to not do anything that doesn't feel good. Inhale, come back up to neutral, let the breath go. Now inhale here. Exhale, look over the right shoulder. Inhale to center. Exhale, look over the left shoulder. A few more times to each side, the inhale through center, the exhale to one of the sides. Do your best to keep the top of the head aligned over the heart. The shoulders remain stationary so that you only feel this movement in the neck. And once you feel even on both sides, return to neutral, take a releasing breath. 